Oh, no. It's you again. All right, all right. I'm excited. All right, then. No funny business. We're doing a spotlight, so let's go. So you've been wanting to play the hog rather, and you've been having some trouble. Well, fear not, this video's for you. I'm gonna show you guys how the pros use them and how the hog riders are still good. Now, these guys are not for everybody, but I have seen some other players use them, so let's jump in there and see how they do it. Yeah, we're going in and we got Sneaky Dave in the dark. He's versus Nazgul from Clan of Mayhem. So let's see what he does first. It looks like he's using the balloons to maybe pull out those CC troops. That's usually a good idea. If you don't have enough hogs to spare, use another troop that can get in close and pull out those CC troops. Now you can't take heroes over there, but you can't take the other guys. So, take him to the corner and beat him down. There's no rule against that. And of course, have your wizards and witches to back you up. The reason why is because they keep spawning troops for you. And they make it difficult for the enemy teams to get in close. And looks like he's gonna do a little push with his heroes to get inside take out their heroes especially the queen I think she's the number one thing that you're gonna go for so now that the queen's out of the way the hog riders are going to work maybe it's just cuz the king's too slow you can't keep up with uh, the black dudes on the animals they're breaking everything and they're running away yep it's almost case closed. Whoa. It looked really easy if you ask me. Well, that's a 50% right there. And it looks like he's going for the three star actually. So we're gonna go ahead and speed it up so you guys can see this. and he takes everything out. Awesome raid by Sneaky Dave. Thank you so much. Let's go to the next one. And it's, I don't even know how to say that. Cat, Captain, I curve, uh, something. Versus a big old Duda. What's up with you guys? All these weirdo names. From Quantum Arab, with Arab, yeah. Big shout out. <laughs> shout out if I get your name wrong. But these guys are going to work. So if you want to be successful with your hog rider raid, make sure you take those clan castle troops, take them out. And of course, they got the witches going. And the wizards, always a good idea. Stop those party poopers from getting to you. This looks like a standoff. The hog riders are gonna have some work cut out for them. <laughs> we gonna rock it. We gonna rock it, brother. You gotta rock it. The hog riders, they going in. Get a shot of that. Oh, bang! Whip! Whoa! Man, that's enough, that's enough. Yeah, they done break, they broke it off. And they still going. All right, so they deploy the free spell. That's always a good idea. Now that they're out of the hot box. 
Just get that infernal tower. That's the number one thing. So that's a really good strategy. And this is always good because no one expects you to use hog riders now. So take advantage. It's a case closed. They took out that town hall and there's only a little bit left. So you guys, if you notice the strategy, he's just taking out the heroes, doing it like usual, protecting his hard riders with the free spells, the heal spells. Most of these bases aren't really prepared for it. So you guys, this is how you do it. And that was an awesome raid. Thank you guys for watching. This is Godson. Be sure to subscribe for more. And I will see you guys next time. Godson out. Better get that bad look off your face before I knock it off. Everything was cool in there? You know it was, brother. <laughs>